Vince would probably say that our relationship is kind of brothers, blood brothers maybe. Me being the older, older brother, him being the tall, handsome, talented younger brother who, uh, you know, sometimes the only trump card you have to play in a, in a blood brother situation is that I'm older than you, pal, so listen to me. Yeah, that's about the only card I got to play. My role in the show is to uh, to paint a picture of, of Vince in his early years in Southern California when we first met. Emmy Lou and I will will do that, and uh, it's a sweet memory. The first time you meet somebody like Vince, unforgettable unfor moment, uh, and, and you know a treasured moment. So the, the good thing about it is that we don't have to make anything up or read teleprompters, you know, we just speak from our hearts. One word to describe Vince, just one word. Got two. Beautiful every man. Word for word, it's, it's a lyric book of mine, comes out tomorrow, 13th. Um, the lyrics to 155 songs that I chose personally, the ones I like the best. Um, 70 or so pages of prose that I wrote at backstories, side stories, meanderings and what have you. Um, it's a testimonial from Roseanne Cash in it that's really sweet and lovely. A little piece from Harlan Howard from when he was still alive way back. Um, a lot of uh, archival stuff, uh, first drafts of songs, you know, with coffee stains and, you know, perfectly fine couplets that I now don't understand why I didn't use this in the song in the first place, that kind of thing. Um, a lot of art and a lot of photography and a afterthought by a young 18-year-old kid who's a big fan of mine who's a very eloquent writer and I said I'm going to let this guy have the last word in this book lovely guy Marty Stewart took the photo on the cover it was at backstage at the Grand Ole Opry it must have been 1983 somewhere there my, uh, my memory of it um, I was walking down the hallway and Marty had his camera in his hand he stopped me and snapped one shot I said, I'll catch you later. And that was it. He sent it to me later on. I said, God, Marty, you're good. So it was, it was the uh, photograph that I wanted for the cover of the book, mainly because it was right in the middle of my career, or meh, closer to the earlier part of my career, but at the time it seemed like this is close to the middle of my career.